Hello everyone, welcome back to Simbright Fashion Academy YouTube ch channel once again today on another interesting tutorial. So today's tutorial will be focusing on the layers cape we have on the uh, off shoulder dress on the thumbnail. So we want to form those layers as you are seeing right here, right there on the off shoulder. So for that reason we have the off shoulder bodies and we have an up shoulder sleeve okay so this up shoulder sleeve you are seeing right here i have a detailed video on how to make it on this channel so now on my up shoulder bodies this is the shoulder so if you are new to this channel please kindly subscribe turn on your notification bell to receive videos like this every day like this video share to family and friends and drop your comments on the comment section and your suggestions as well. So you can see me noting the chest, the bust point, under bust and waistline. So if you don't know how to make a basic bodies, we have a basic bodies on this channel. How to make an accurate basic bodies. You can check it out to learn how to make a basic pattern. Of course, the basic bodies pattern... We usually use it to start up any design or any style of dress you want to make. You need your full basic body pattern. So for this off shoulder, I'm going to off my shoulder. You can go by three, four, five, six, seven as you desire. So, but for this particular dress, I'm my off shoulder. I'm making it at five inches because I've already constructed my off shoulder sleeve using uh, five inches so at the five inches i'm going to start up my off shoulder so right now i'll be taking the i, I will be drawing the line okay we are supposed to make the uh, do the first thing first and the first thing is first is the shoulder seam line, dividing it into two equal halves for our upper bust contouring and con con uh, to connect it to the bust point. So at this point, we are going to contour our over bust. And I love to contour by 0 0.75 because it, act it actually works perfectly for everybody. So, but if you have a very little bust, you can use 0 0.5, 0 0.5. So I'm connecting what I have here to the bust point like this. And I'm going to flip my ruler and I'll connect to the bust point as well. So that means that everything we have right here, we are going to take them away. So for an off shoulder, normally what you have on your on your shoulder your shoulder divide by two which is what we measure this is our center front so what i did here was the my full shoulder divide by two my shoulder is 15 inches i divided it by two and i have 7.5 so normally for off shoulders as i have 7.5 the calculation for your off shoulder is to minus what you have with 1.5 Somebody minus, uh, some people minus theirs with two inches, okay, for sh off shoulder connections. But I love to work with 1.5 because it matches with what I have right here. So, what that means is that the that, what, the, that is 1.5. So, once 1.5 is taken out of that, automatically it matches with our calculation. So there won't be any need to replace any that again because once we cut off this, it matches up with this calculation for off shoulder. Okay, so once 7.5 is taken away from 1.5, we have 6 inches. So if you measure what you have right here, taking away the that, it matches up accordingly. Okay? Alright, so there won't be any replacement of any that. That is what I'm the not and shell of uh, what we are talking about so from here i'm going to connect my off shoulder sleeve can you see my off shoulder armhole so the off shoulder armhole is slanted it's usually slanted can you see like this so we are not working with this for off shoulder okay this is for normal basic body sleeve for off shoulder you need to slant your uh, pattern ruler 
So that is it for the off shoulder. So the main purpose of this tutorial is the uh, the design, okay, not to draft an off shoulder, but then it's okay. So the sleeve we have now. So your neckline, you can now design your neckline. If you want a four corner or you want a sweetheart, this is it. If you want sweetheart, you go by this. If you want a straight four corner, you go by that. So now the sleeve I have, like I said, is constructed using what we have right here. Okay, what we have uh, right, that's the off we off. That is how uh, we drafted this list. So it depends on how off. So if you watch that video, you actually know what I'm talking about. The off shoulder sleeve video. All right, people. So we are going to match up this sleeve now. The sleeve will be connected from here. So I'll pretend matching up. Okay. I will pretend matching up to make that, um, uh, that those uh, curves that uh, those uh, layers we have on the thumbnail. So I'm going to just pretend drafting or taking the sleeve like this. So this is my sleeve drafted. Please don't get yourself confused with these calculations. The neckline runs from here and it goes into here and this is the end of the sleeve so now what we have on the panel be before we continue i want to cut off this please so we get a clearer picture of how to go about uh, the design so i'm cutting by the sleeve because that is actually what we are working with I'm going to cut cut the sleeve we just traced out with the off shoulder to this point. Okay, I will cut to this point. I'll take off what I have at the center front. Okay. I'll cut off what I have on the sides. Okay. So actually what we want to work with is the, we want to just pretend we've joined our sleeve. So we'll be able to get that uh, pattern. So I will just cut off my bust that now. So I take off that over bust, over bust that, okay. So this is the over bust that, and I'm taking it away, okay? So once I take it away, I close up my bust that. So I close up my bust that. So once my boss that is closed, next I will do, I close up the boss that, then I open up my, the waist that. Of course the waist that will be cut off. So at the end of the day, we have, this is a front one and front two. So what I'm trying to, uh, uh, what I want to do here is to ensure I have this together before we can do whatever thing we want to do. So remember, you need to fill in this space, okay? If you have been following our tutorials, you need to match up what you have here and here for a perfect fit. So, but for now, this is what we want to do. So I will just put my, gum them together. I just gum this part a little so we'll be able to do what we want to do right now. So it's time to construct what we have on that uh, particular uh, layered design. So this is the sleeve. You can see the neckline running into the sleeve. So from that point, we'll start our construction. 